Oh, there's Frankie. Hey, Frankie, what's up, man? Oh, what's up, bro? Hey, what are you up to? Not much. About to listen to some tunes on the bike right here. How are you going to do that? Check it out. I got these new speakers from leatherup.com. Let me show you how it works. Oh, dude, those look nice. Yeah, kick ass. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How are you going to listen to music uh, with the engine like that? Hey, well, let's hope it's loud enough. Let's see. Let's check it out. First thing you got to do is turn it on by hitting the button. And what will happen is that the lights will come on to indicate that it's on. So once I you got it. that going, you want to go to your phone next. Go to your phone, turn on your Bluetooth, and what it'll do, it'll go back to the very last song that you were playing. And you ain't gotta hit play, all you gotta do is just turn up the volume. Check it out. Are we gonna be able volume, to hear it? Let's hope so, let's check it out. Oh, that is loud. What? <laughs> That's loud, dude. Oh, yeah. And it's cool, you can change songs right from here. Look, on the other speaker, if you toggle to the right, you skip forward. Same thing, go backwards. Go back to the back song. Also, too, it comes with this pretty cool remote right here where you can skip songs as well. It offers a, a function button as well, so if you don't have a Bluetooth device, you can connect a, another device like an MP3 player or an iPod. How do you do that? It has a USB mode right here. Plug it into the USB, hardwired. So if you don't have a Bluetooth device, no worries, we got you. So you can hardwire instead of going through the Oh, Bluetooth. yeah. That's great. All you gotta do is just crank the volume. I can't get over how loud it is, man. Oh yeah. That sounds good too. Hell yeah. Well, dude, thanks man. I appreciate it. No problem. Take care. Enjoy the music. Thank you. I'll talk to you later, man. See you later.